This is the DW9000 series kick pedal. This thing is an absolute legend when it comes to performance, reliability, the build quality is absolutely insane. The amount of steel that is in this kick pedal is ridiculous. Just feeling the weight of how heavy this thing is. Now I've been using this kick pedal for about two years now and so far I'm super super happy. I even have the double kick variety as well. I also have the 9000 series hardware. Now you might think it's a little overkill and this is true but I've been touring for a long time. I've been playing the drums for a long time so I can justify the purchase a little more than somebody who's just beginning. So I've used the 3000 series, the 5000 series, and now I'm using 9000 series. You really get what you pay for when it comes to hardware in a lot of cases. I've had kick pedals literally break on stage during a show and <laughs> There was one time where I didn't have a kick pedal next to me. So that's a helpful tip for anyone out there. Make sure you always have a kick pedal and even a snare drum, backup snare drum, next to you at all times, trust me. Fortunately, there was a guy from the other band who quick brought his kick pedal out and we were able to continue playing normally. But in a situation like that, you really need to have the most high quality and dependable equipment. The clamp that attaches to the kick drum hoop has these little rubber pads on them, which is really nice so you can clamp down. And it's not gonna damage your hoop, though I still like to put something in between there, like a piece of felt or rubber, just to be extra safe. Then you also get a nice little drum key here, so you have one always ready to go on stage. Very nice. These spurs though, with a lot of bass drum pedals, you have to be careful because these will poke into your carpet and potentially poke through to your hardwood floors or whatever kind of flooring you have down. So you have to be very, very cognizant of that. Kick beater that you get is very standard. It's a DW kick beater with felt, and then you can turn it around like I've got this electric kit here. Always want to use the plastic side if you're using mesh head. As far as how it feels to play, it, it feels very firm and springy right out of the box, so there's really not that much adjustment you need to do. The cam is adjustable right here. They have this DW Infinite adjustable cam. I've never had to mess with this, but I'm sure you can, depending on how you want your, where you want your uh, beater to be. But overall, super solid kick pedal. Can't recommend it enough. They're a little pricey, so if you're gonna go for something a little bit more on the cheaper end, I would maybe go for the 5000 series. As a beginner, go Yamaha. Yamaha makes a great entry-level pedal for like 80 bucks. You can't go wrong. The 9000 retails at 400 bucks, so it's kind of hard to justify that expensive of a purchase, but it is a solid kick pedal. The base plate features a non-slip grip, you can also switch this chain out with a nylon strap that they've included. I've never really tried that, but it'd be interesting. I've always felt like the chain is just more solid and feels better to me. Maybe I'll try it, maybe I'll have a different opinion. That's about it though with the DW9000 kick pedal. Have you ever tried one or used one? You know, if you go to the music store, they usually have like 15 of these different pedals set up. So if you're looking to get a new pedal, just go there and just hit them. The only problem with some of those, like if you're in Guitar Center or something, a lot of times those pedals are just super worn out or, you know, they're, they're all the adjustments are all weird. So you do have to remember that, that getting a brand new pedal, it might be a little bit different. But I'm curious if you've ever tried this pedal or like, what's your favorite pedal out there? You know, I've used DW mostly. I've had some Pearl stuff in the past, but I'm really kind of exclusive to DW now. Let me know your thoughts down below. I am affiliated with Sweetwater. Down below, you can check the pedal out on their website. And if you buy it, I will make a small commission. Thank you guys for watching the DW9000. See you all in the next video.